Hey everyone, I'm Victor Hugo, I'm 15 years old, I study at Freguesia Branch and I'm from Intermediate 3. Today, I'm here on Teachers 4 d to talk about my routine. I'm a swimmer and I swim since I was 3 years old. I really love to do that because while I am swimming, I can just relax and forget about everything else. So, this helped me a lot and I really love to do that. So, in these pictures, you can see me very young in the pool, of course, I love it. And in the second one, you can also see my cousin, who is now living in California. We used to swim and do a lot of things together, and I really miss her. But let's gonna talk about my routine, right? So, first up, I wake up at 4.30 a.m. Oh my god, it's too early. But I wake up with this mood and because at 5 a.m. I have my first swimming training. These ones have the duration of more or less one hour and at 6 p.m. I have my first gym training. The both I make with two of my best friends and it's very fun, we laugh a lot and I really like it because in the morning it's more techniques and stuff like that, you know, so it's more easy. So, at 7 p.m. I come back home and I start watching my online classes for school. And these ones I watch until 1 p.m. more or less, but I keep studying until 2 p.m. And in this time, I lunch while I am studying because I don't have time before or after so I have to lunch while I am studying and I keep studying how I say until 2 p.m. because at 2 30 I have my f f second gym training this one is with the whole team and this is my team I really love them because they are very funny and we have a lot of things together you know so this photo was taken before the quarantine starts, so that's why we are not wearing masks and this. But now we are following the golden rules and stuff like that, so it's okay, right? So this is my team, this I really love them, how I said. And this in the second training, in the second gym training, we it's more heavy, you know, it's more longer and had the duration of more or less one hour so at we have before we have like 30 minutes of rest because at 4 p.m i have my main training this one is the stronger and the more important training that we have because it's the main training you know so we swim a lot swim hard and this me and my team training this photo was taken I think last week if I'm not mistaken and it's very nice training with them I really like it and in this photo was oh my god this train was very very hard because one of the hardest that I ever had so it was very good so I come back home and in Tuesdays and Thursdays I have my online Ideos classes and I watch in car you know so it starts at 6 50 p.m 6 15 p.m and my train my main train is, uh, ends at 6 10 p.m so i have to run to get on the ebay's classes and it's very hard but i really like it and this starts at 6 15 p.m and ends at 7 30 p.m but just on Thursdays and Tuesday and Thursdays and but I end the the Bills classes at home so it's not so so bad and I really like it so in normal days like Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays I just get home and keep studying studying, 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 studying until 9 and 9 30 because it's the time I have to study you know and I have to do that right so I said it until 9 and 9 30 p.m. and at that time I go bed for finally have my rest and finally get sleep so 
this is my routine it's very 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 exhaustive but it has its compensations in these photos you can see me of course and in the first one you can see I was in nationals championship that's a very important competition right and in the second one I was in a South America competition but it's very important too in the both I get the third place on relays so I wasn't expecting you know so it was magical really it, it was a magical moment so it's very good and I oh my god I remember this until today you know so it's very good and in the second one I was just smile and lay down you know because I just swam at the morning because I was I have some problems but I get the medal too because I swim at morning and the guys swim in the afternoon so in this one you can see me in the United States this one is very important to me this photo because I was I was swimming for a school and it was my first time in the United States so just for that it's very very important but I was swimming and in this championship I got the fourth place on an individual race yeah the fourth place and fifty in the fifth place on relay me and the guys so oh my god it's very very good because we almost get the podium so it was very important too and in the United States that the swimming is very very strong and important so I really happy and that's it you no know? so even having a exhaustive routine had the compensation all right and I will I also like to give some tips for you I study I want to be a doctor so it's very hard you know so I how I can do that you know study and swim at the same time I also I always I always use a post-it and with the hardest subjects you know or something I have difficulties so I put in somewhere I can read every time you know oh I just passing oh I can read that in my bedroom of course oh I am doing a lot a other thing I'm watching a video but I can see that so some formulas some tags little text and I cook and I put in my my wall and it helps me a lot to decorate and to remember really and that's that's the main idea and at the swimming I think it's very important to you have a good mind you know so a mindset a strong mindset is very important and sometimes you are not good you are not uh, you're not swimming good or making another sport, but it's just a phase, you know, everyone has phase, you can ask, everyone has phase, and you have to just relax and think in, in what you can improve, what you can be better, so that's my tips, don't give up, always follow your dream because it has compensations and it's really, really, really good. So that's it guys that was my video i hope you had enjoyed see you around and bye